Hello guys, good morning. Welcome back to Ram's Tutorial. So today's video, we're going to discuss our tackles about different equations or problems involving mathematics. Remember, my dear students, when we see at mathematics, that involves sequence of numbers, sequence of problems that involves many solutions. Regarding through counting process, it helps us a lot on how to solve different problems. Through applying different skills, listening, motivating ourselves, and love of it. Good morning, my dear students. Good morning, class. We're going to discuss about square or binomial using FOIL method. When we see it, FOIL method means F stands for first term, O stands for outer term, I stands for inner term, L stands for last term. This is what we call the FOIL method that we're going to apply to answer the following equations in math using square of binomials. Okay, let's have first our examples in solving this one. Remember class, we have the tips in, a, in solving the square of binomial. The first tip is you are going to multiply the first term to the exponent, then gate the product of the first and second term, then multiply it by 2, then the second term, or the last part is you are going to multiply the second term to the exponent, and that was the final product of square of binomials. Here we go. We're going to start with the first term, given the question rather, m plus n squared. Okay? So first, my dear viewers, we're going to solve the first term, which is m. m multiplied here. M, m squared. Why m squared? m times m. It's just because you are going to multiply it twice. And that's why the result is m squared. That means to say m times m. M times M, okay? So the result is M squared. This one, guys. Next, plus, okay, the product of two terms, we have M times N. So we have M times N times 2. The result is 2 M N. That means to say, guys, you multiply the two term first term and second term then multiplied by 2 the result is 2 mn plus second term which is n n times n we have n squared we're going to write here n squared this will be our final answer for Letter A, M plus N squared. The answer is M squared plus 2MN plus N squared. Again, guys, multiply for the first term. Get the product of the first term, which is here, M times M. We have M squared. So we're going to write here the answer, M squared, plus design. Then get the product of M and N times 2 we have 2 mn next the second term the square of this is the first term of the square binomial second term of the square binomial so we have n squared we have n times n okay that was the result these are what we call the procedure or tips on how to solve square of binomial using the foil method letter b we have a minus b squared get first the value of first first term rather a we have the exponent 2 we're going to multiply that twice we have a times a we have a squared we're going to write here a squared okay in the max minus so we have times a times b times 2 okay first term and second term multiplied get the product then multiplied by 2 then we have 2 a b okay plus multiply the second term which is b we have 
b times b we have b squared we're going to write here b squared this will be the answer for a and b we have here a okay a minus b squared the answer is a squared minus 2ab plus b squared again guys all you have to do first get the first term square binomial then the first term and second term of a nominal multiply then 2 get the product of 2 then multiply it by 2 this was the result 2 ev then the second term multiplied twice with exponent 2 the result is b squared that's why the answer is a squared minus 2 a b plus b squared okay did you understand about our example guys in getting the square of binomial that's easy guys all you have to do is to follow our examples and tips and procedure on how to solve the different equations in math let's proceed to our exercises exercises guys that means to say this is what we call our motivation process wherein you and your teachers of course discuss it thoroughly number one equations 9x minus 4y squared okay we get first the first term 9x we have here the base we are going to multiply the 2 9 times 9 so we have first here guys data 9 times 9 so the result is 81 you jot down here 81 x squared okay minus then get the product of the first term and second term 9 times 4 we have 36 times 2 okay 2 times 6 is 12 bring down 2 regroup 1 6 plus 1 72 we're going to write here guys 72 x y plus the second term 4 y squared so 4 times 4 We have 16 y squared. This will be our answer, guys. It's easy, right? Okay, that is for the result of 9x minus 4y squared. Number 3. Okay. Number 2, rather. 3x plus 5y squared. First term, guys. So we have 3 times 3 is 9x squared. 9x squared okay first term get the product of first and second term times 2 3 times 5 is 15 times 2 is 30 x y okay 30 x y next is plus second term 5 y squared so 5 times 5 is 25 y times y is y squared so we are answering it okay that is 9 x squared plus 30 x y plus 25 y squared that will be our answer for number 2 number 3 4x squared 4x squared y 4x squared y squared okay so this is first term lang for siya guys 4x squared y so first is 4 times 4 16 okay x times s is x squared 4 y squared okay that's our answer it's only first term that was for number three next number four okay number four 
Number four, we have two x plus three y squared. Get first the first term, guys. Two x. So ibig sabihin, we are going to multiply two times two. We have four x squared plus get the product of first and second we have 2 times 3 is 6 times 2 is 12 xy plus 3y squared 3 times 3 guys is 9y squared 9y squared this will be the answer guys okay where did you get 4x squared so we have 2 times 2 we have 4 x times x x squared so therefore we have 4 x squared 12 we have 2 times 3 6 times 2 12 x y it's 1 3 y squared 3 times 3 we have 9 y times y we have y squared so 9 y squared it's 1 okay that's it guys how you are going to solve let's proceed to number 5 number 5 a minus b squared same procedure guys first term a a times a times a is equal to a squared we're going to write a squared minus first and second term multiplied a times b is a b times 2 so we have 2 a b okay plus b times b we have b squared Okay, that's simple. That is our number five. Let's proceed to number six, guys. Okay, let's continue. Okay, so that you will understand what is square of binomial. Another questions 5m minus 4, then exponent, guys, squared. Same procedure, first term 5 times 5. It's 25. Okay. M times M. M squared. We need detailed explanation. So we are going to combine 25 M squared. We're going to write here. 25 M squared. Minus. This will be for the first term. Multiplied. Getting the product of first term and second term. 5 times 4. We have 20 times 2 that's 40 m okay plus second term 4 4 times 4 is 16 so we have 25 m squared minus 40 m plus 16 okay another number 7 the last number guys number seven so we have for number seven so seven a plus four b so same procedure guy first term seven a that means to say seven times seven guy we get 49 a times a is a squared Combine it, we have 49a squared. First term yun na sagot. We're going to write here the first answer. 49a squared plus getting the next product for the first term and second term. 7 times 4, the result guy is 28 times 2. Okay, we're going to write 28 times 2, I think 56. 16, 4, 5. Okay. 56 a b okay plus 
last term guy 4b squared 4 times 4 16 b times b b squared okay so our answer is 16 b squared okay hope guys you learn a lot out of this video tutorial about the square of binomial using foil method if you have any questions or suggestion guys please comment for our comment suggestion box below and don't forget to hit the notification bell icon so that you're updated to our latest tutorial don't forget to subscribe it once again so long class thank you for watching bye bye and god bless us and mabuhay